Tonight is opening night at the 54 San Francisco International Film Festival. I'm Hannah Hunt with Grolsch Filmworks and I'll be giving you an inside look at the longest running festival in the United States. What is the secret to the success of this festival? If you stick with a formula um, and don't stay ahead of the curve or constantly be looking to discover new things, you're going to get tired. And we would have to assume, because we're still around after 54 years, that we haven't gotten tired yet. What would you tell young aspiring filmmakers who are submitting their work to festivals like this? It Head sounds question. like a cliche, but my advice is really just be true to yourself. Because a lot of people ask questions about what festivals are looking for, what kind of films they're looking for, and really what most festival programmers are looking for is something that feels like it's a unique voice. Mike Mills is here tonight to screen his new film, Beginners, starring Ewan McGregor, and we're here to check it out. The film's a lot about my dad who came out of the closet when he was 75, so showing it here is like, uh, I'm beyond nervous and honored and, and missing my dad a lot today. Why was Beginners chosen to premiere at the festival this year? Mostly because we just loved it. Um, but also, it's just such a great film uh, to start with because it's got everything. Uh, it's happy and it's sad, it's got great laughs, but it's got real emotion. And all that um, told with a style that's really individual, it's a, he's got a really unique voice. So to be able to highlight all those things in one opening night film, kind of perfect. Beginners is the second feature film for Mills and the latest in a series of autobiographically based works. It's a huge honor, uh, not just that it's my life, but like as a filmmaker, watching, having the audience watch it, it's like the thing you work for forever and to uh, have their attention like that for a hundred minutes mm -hmm. is a pretty crazy honor yeah. and feels really sweet. I've always been a huge fan of his work from even before when he was doing uh, when he, all of his graphic work and, and, um, and I love Thumbsucker. And, uh, and when this came up, it was kind of, for me, it was a dream come true, really. I mean, because he is just a, a really, he's a great guy to work with, first of all, and a uh, consummate artist. And, yeah. and, um, and he's really giddy, mm -hmm. like he's really effusive when yeah. working with him, so it's really, it's really nice. Yeah. What is it like to have Ewan McGregor play you on the screen? That's well, that's embarrassing, because <laughs> like, uh, that's like my most embarrassing moment, because obviously he's a much more handsome, more charismatic guy. Couldn't have worked out better. Like, he's uh, just a great friend.